You say I make you nervous, a tragedy, I'm a beautiful disaster, a reckoning, you wonder how I got this way. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm filming a purple eyeshadow look for you guys. I got a request to do this and people complimenting it. So I also asked you guys if you guys wanted me to film this and 91% of you guys said yes. So that's what I'm going to do. So to start off, I'm going to use this Maybelline concealer in the shade Fair Claire on both of my eyelids. I then grab a small beauty blender and just blend all that out on both sides. With a bigger beauty blender, I grab some Airspun Loose Face Powder in the shade Translucent and I just use that to set the concealer. And then you just grab whatever fluffy brush you have and I just dust off the excess face loose powder and I'm using a Morphe brush for this one. So to start off we're going to use the James Charles Morphe palette and I start off by using the darker purple shade that's on the palette. This one right there. And I grab a Morphe M506 brush and I just grab some of that shade and I use it all over my face. I use a little yeah, bit and then I add more product as I go. I feel like it blends in better that way. I do that on both eyes I use the same morphe m506 brush but this time I'm grabbing the light purple shade and the hot pink shade these two right here and I'm using these two shades a little bit above my crease and I use it to blend out that purple shade but upwards <laughs> After I do that on both sides, I grab this clean M332 Morphe brush with no product on it. I just use it to blend all those colors and clean. Then after what I like to do is go back in with that purple shade with the same um, Morphe M506 brush. And I like to make the crease a little bit darker because I feel like when you cut the crease, it like adds more definition to the look. So just keep blending it out and add how much purple you want depending on how dark you want it to look, the crease. And I do that to the other side, and now that it's done, I'm going to start cutting my crease. And I use the Smashbox concealer in the shade Light Medium Cool and this random flat Morphe brush. And I apply some of the concealer on the back of my hand just like so. And what I like to do is I start from the inner corner and like I outline a little bit above my actual crease line, just like that. And I slowly outline it and bring it up. I realized how hard this was to film on camera, so I'm gonna do it off camera and I'll be right back. So now that that's done, it should look something like this. And I grab the white shade from the James Charles palette and I use it to set the whole concealer on the eyelid. Now I use this thicker brush and I grab the shimmer shade, the shimmer purple shade from the James Charles palette, and I apply it almost all over my crease, the cut crease, but I leave a little bit at the end. I like to stop right about there and then I do it on both of my eyelids. 
And now I'm gonna go in with the Jaclyn Hill Morphe palette and I apply the dark purple shimmer shade that's on that palette, that one right there, with the same thin brush that I used to apply the light one. I just grab some of that and I just tap it on the end, just like that. And I like to, I blend in the light purple shade with the um, matte shadows that I used earlier. Then what I like to do is I also flip the brush on the clean side just like that and I just blend it in. It makes it easier for me, at least. Now that we've done that to both of our eyelids, I get the same M332 brush from earlier and I grab the dark purple shade we used. And I like to use that at the end of the eye Any just ideas? to add more definition to the look. I feel like this adds more dimension to it and it just looks better. It looks cleaner and nicer. I don't know how to explain it. After I do that on both eyes, I grab some lash glue and my lashes and I apply them. And now I'm gonna just do my face makeup and I'll be right back. Now that that's done, I'm gonna grab a thick, small brush, just like this, and I'm gonna grab that purple shade that we used earlier, and I'm gonna apply it on the bottom of my lash line. I do that on both of my eyes, and then after I grab the light purple shade with the same brush, and I use it a little bit underneath, but I use it to blend in both of those colors together. After I'm finished, I apply some mascara and then I grab a white liner and I apply that on my lash line. For the inner corners, I use um, the Jaclyn Hill palette, the white shimmer shade with a thin brush. And for my brow bones, I like to use the Anastasia Belly Hills Glow Kit in Sun Dip. So this is the final look. I hope you guys like it. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments below. Also, if you guys have any constructive criticism, also please let me know. And don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I will be back with more videos. Bye!